good to go. And the smallest man on the floor, Aismith, comes away with it. And gang rebounding essential for the Golden Eagles against the taller, stronger Ohio State club. And I told you, this guy can shoot from anywhere, Bird. Woo! Wow, they call him Midcourt Max. Max Aismith, Midcourt Max. How'd that nickname start? Uh, I think it started with um, actually the president's son uh, on Twitter. Uh, I think it was one game. I, I guess I hit it like a logo shot and he made core max and that kind of stuck with everybody. And now you keep doing it. I mean, the logo is big here. But... Yeah, it got a little bigger yeah. over, the, over the summer, but yeah, <laughs> just making, you know, logo shots and that's kind of what stuck with it. You did that on a national level. March Madness, a game against Ohio State when you guys knocked him off in the first round. It's March! Expect the unexpected! 15 two upsets don't happen that often. You guys were able to do it. Mm -hmm. It gained immediate national notoriety. Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden your name was all over the place. Mm -hmm. Overnight like that, how did that feel? How did you react? I mean, it's crazy. You know, it's, um, I don't know how to describe it. You know, you, gotta, you just gotta be in it. Um, but for me, it, was, it wasn't about just necessarily that national attention, you know. We were at the tournament to, you know, continue to win games and continue our season. And so that was really where my focus was, is just, you know, continue to win games so we could keep playing. And you flirted with going on and playing professionally. A couple of years, you entered the process for the draft. You know, what have those experiences taught you the last couple of seasons? I mean, they've been great. Um, you know, everybody's goal is to, to get to the highest level. Um, and so. To be that close to that level um, is definitely a blessing. Um, but you know, going through it, I also realized you know there's some stuff that I can definitely um, you know improve on so that I can be better, um, put myself in a better position. And so, I mean, just a couple big things I learned was just for one, just you got to bring it every day. You know, uh, the NBA season is 82 games. Um, you know, you're traveling city to city, and so you got to bring it every day. And another thing with that is just taking care of your body. Um, it's big that. Do your recovery. Um, do everything you can to, so that your body can be, you know, rested and ready to play in, you know, 82 games. Over the offseason, you got to work out with NBA All Star Trey Young, mm -hmm. uh, a guy who, similar in stature, you guys play the same position at point guard. Uh, also shoots from the logo and a little bit more. How important is that to the success that you're having this season? Yeah, I mean, it was a great experience. Um, you know, working out, you know, with NBA All Star like him. Um, you know, who's had success at the level that I'm trying to get to. Um, so just, you know, trying to pick up little things from the workout, um, little things that, you know, help him get that success um, was definitely big for me. And so I'm um, just trying to put some of that in my game um, to see what can help me, you know, as well to, you know, reach that level. I think there's a lot of people out there that see the, the style of basketball that's being played now, not just at the NBA level, but also at college. Mm -hmm. And, you know, a lot of it has to do with this three-point line and playing beyond that. Uh, but there's more to it where you know, a little hesitation and then the blow by and you're able to lay it up. At six feet tall, you're playing with guys that are much taller. Right. How important is you know the ability to change speeds and, and mix it up and not just be a, a one tool player? Right, I think that's big. Um, you know, it, it makes it tougher to guard you. Um, so defenses can't just play you if you're a one dimension. You know, if you're a one dimension player, they can play you a lot easier. Whereas you can you know score from three different levels. And so um, having every aspect of that to my game is something that you know I've always wanted to work on. So um, just taking what the defense gives me. You know, they can't take away everything. And so um, just taking what they give me and you know using what uh, the tools in my game. This season is so important for you and your career personally. Why? It's important, you know, it's the, this is the last dance right here. And so I want to end with a bang. And so, you know, a couple years ago, you know, we had the Sweet 16 run. And, you know, our goal is to win a championship and get back to, to March Madison and try to make another run.